This clock has one hand. It is the hour hand. It is pointing to the one. The time is one o'clock. The digital clock is below. The hour hand is pointing to the two. The time is two o'clock. One hour of time has passed since one o'clock. The hour hand is pointing to the four. The time is four o'clock. Three hours have passed since one o'clock. The hour hand moved so it is between four and five. A half hour of time has passed since four o'clock. The time is half past four o'clock. The hour hand moves so it points to the five. A half hour of time has passed. What time is it? The time is five o'clock. Time passes in seconds, minutes, hours, days, weeks, months, and years. This is an analog clock. It has two hands pointing at the number 12 and the numbers 1 through 12 arranged clockwise on its face. This is a digital clock. The numbers on the display change and AM and PM is shown. 12 p.m. noon is shown like this. 12 a.m. midnight is shown like this. 1 a.m. The little hand points to the hour. The big hand points to the minutes. The big hand straight up is zero minutes. On a digital clock, the hour is before the colon. The minutes are after the colon. Hour, colon, minutes, 1 o'clock a.m. Two minutes after 1 a.m. The little hand points to the 1. The big hand points to the second dot. One thirty a.m. 30 minutes after 1 o'clock. A half hour after 1 o'clock. Half past 1 o'clock. The little hand points in between the 1 and the 2. The big hand points to the 6, the 30th dot. The next pictures show what you might see at different times during one day. The second hand is fastest. It's long, thin, and often colored red. It's not always on a clock, but it is the third hand if it's on there. Time. There are 60 seconds in one minute, 60 minutes in one hour, 24 hours in one day, 7 days in one week, 28, 29, 30 or 31 days in one month, 365 days in one year. One minute. 
The second hand rotates all the way around the clock. The minute hand moves to the next dot. It's hard to see if the hour hand is even moved. On a digital clock, one gets added to the minutes. One hour and 30 minutes plus one minute equals one hour and 31 minutes. One hour. The second hand spins 60 times around. The minute hand spins once around. The hour hand moves to the next number, five dots. On a digital clock, one gets added to the hour. One hour, 31 minutes, plus one equals two hours, 31 minutes. The minutes have counted from 30 to 59 and from zero to 30 in one hour. There are 24 hours in a day, but only 12 hours on a clock. The first 12 hours are a.m., the second 12 hours are p.m. The hands end exactly where they started one day later. In one day, on a digital clock, the minutes have counted from 30 to 59, and then 0 to 30, 24 times. The hours have gone from 1 a.m. to 12 p.m., and then 12 p.m. to 12 a.m., and then 12 a.m. to 1 a.m. Joe's favorite TV show starts at 4 p.m. It's 3.30 p.m. How many hours and minutes before the show starts? 30 minutes. 30 minutes is a half hour. Joe eats dinner at 6 p.m. It is 3.30 p.m. How many hours and minutes until dinner? The hour hand has moved more than two numbers. The minute hand has moved 30 minutes plus two times around. That is two and a half hours or two hours and 30 minutes. A calendar shows days of the week and days in a month. If you have a calendar, you can put a mark on it each day. You can write notes on it for important dates. The days of the week are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Which days of the week are school days? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. A monthly calendar has a page for each month. The months of the year are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. The month shown here is July of the year 2014. Joe has three months of summer vacation. That's in the hottest months, June, July, and August. Sometimes the months are represented by a number. January is the first month of the year. February is the second month of the year. Skipping down, July is the seventh month of the year. Writing date and time. How could you write the date and time of an 11 a.m. parade for Independence Day 2014? The 4th of July 2014 is a Friday. Dates and times can be written different ways. Here are some examples. Month slash day slash year hours colon minutes colon seconds. How could you write the date and time of a 10 p.m. fireworks show for the 4th of July 2014? 